we start with football and there were only three games this weekend to round up match day number 11. Friday night saw Lynx beat College 4-0, helping them stay in the top four. St. Joseph's finished the weekend top of the table after beating Magpies 3-0. And finally, Manchester 62 got an important three points after winning their match 3-1 against Europa Point. A few matches to look forward to this week. Glasses versus Lions is tomorrow at 8.30 p.m. Europa take on Lynx on Wednesday night at the same time. And Manchester 62 play Magpies on Thursday night at 8.30 p.m. Moving indoors to futsal now, and Zocca Bastian won 5-2 against Monscalpe on Saturday. Spartans beat Bavaria 9-3 to help them keep up the pressure on league leaders Lynx, who dropped points after drawing 4-4 with mid-table side College. Away from the rock now, and the European cross-country championships took place in Lisbon, Portugal yesterday. Harvey Dixon, Cameron Bajaz, Morris Turnock, Richard Blagg and Arnold Rogers all took part. Dixon came in in 70th position with a time of 33 minutes 27 seconds in what was a tough course against top competition. Also away from the rock in swimming now and the European Short Course Swimming Championships took place last week in Glasgow. Jordan Gonzalez, Aidan Carroll and John Paul Vajocchi all competed in what will no doubt be an unforgettable experience for them. In basketball now and this weekend saw the semi-finals of the Youth Cups take place. The finals will all be held from Thursday to Saturday at Tercentenary Hall. On to rowing now and on Saturday, Med Rowing Club edged Calpe to victory in the second race of the new season. Med have now won the Baker Challenge 7K endurance race five years in a row. And finally in pool and the Heineken series finals took place on Saturday night with Kevin Torres beating Michael Vasquez 7-6 in the final. The top eight players in Gibraltar battled it out to become the Heineken Series champion and it was Torres that came out on top to claim the crown and the prize money.